Joining us live now, Katie Compton. She's with the Building for Kids in Appleton. A wonderful event coming up. It's yes. one of your favorites. Tell yes. us about this parade. This one, honestly, is just an awesome event. So this is the Children's Parade. This is our ninth annual. Mm -hmm. It's with our partner, Theta Care. And it's exactly what it sounds like. Kids get to dress up. We say they create their floats mm -hmm. so they can come, you know, kind of as in-depth as they want. Last year, uh, we saw Lego people. We saw a big giant on stilts. Yes. You know, we saw families that got together and kind of created the whole thing. We saw a hockey family that even had the Stanley Cup. Oh. And then it went all the way down to sometimes it was just kids in a princess dress on a bike. So you can kind of <laughs> do it as much as as little as you want. And you still parade. We start in Houdini Plaza. Mm -hmm. We parade down College Avenue. We kind of sort of left and we end up in City Park. So it's okay. a lot of fun. I love this. So you could do the bikes or the wagons. I mean, their floats can be anything, right? Yes. Okay. Just non-motorized, we ask. So it can be wagons. It can be <laughs> Don't bikes. Don't get too creative, right? If, if it's got pedals on it, mm -hmm. if you can pull it, all those things are great. And, and a lot of them, like you're seeing some, some of them on the screen, they, they incorporate that into mm. their costumes. So some of them are very elaborate. Um, we do kind of group ones. We do family ones. It's 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 fun to see the creativity of people coming out and doing this. And I like what you say, the whole family can get involved. So mom and dad yes. can help? Yes, mom and dad can come in costume if they want. Oh. Sometimes the whole family is part of the costume, mm -hmm. and other times it's, it's kind of just the kids doing it. So it's, it's whatever you feel like doing, really. And it doesn't matter. I mean, there's, like you said, there's really no, no, like certain no. way that you want them to go? No, nope, there's no right way to do this. Okay. However you're kind of feeling that day, or you can start now and start creating mm -hmm. it for that day, whatever you want. Now this is in the end of July, so July 26th is mm -hmm. the date that we're doing this. It is a Wednesday night, but you can register right now right at our website. And I love this, that you guys are taking this event to a whole nother level this year, yes. making it a, a huge event. Yes, so we're kind of taking a step up from just the parade. The parade is fantastic, but we want to we wanna make it into more of an event. So before the parade, we have the registration time, mm -hmm. but we'll have 95.9 playing some music. We'll be doing some activities in Houdini Plaza there as the kids get their numbers and get lined up. Then they parade in a city park, and at City Park, there's going to be a food truck rally there, so mm -hmm. lots of different kinds of food. Yes. But we're also, well, City Park itself is a park, so the kids can go play, but we're going to have um, some of our partners doing some activities. Mm -hmm. So uh, the, the public library is going to be there. We have the disc golf club coming to do disc golf stuff with the kids, so they can do that. We usually have large trucks parked out mm -hmm. there. 95.9 again follows us, so they'll be playing music, and we give out awards. And then when dusk starts to fall, the kids can see the Lego Batman movie, which we will be playing outside. Oh, I love this. So a whole yes. family night, just playing for the, the whole night. whole family night. It's just all the way when they fall asleep during Lego Batman, throw them in the car and take them take home. Take them home. That's we right. love it. All right. Thanks, Katie. The ninth annual Children's Parade taking place on Wednesday, July 26th in downtown Appleton. You must register for this event. To get signed up, just visit our website. Tech Talk is up next.